Peace. Typically, when you hear vitamin C, what food do you think of? Usually, when you hear vitamin C, that is associated with an orange. But there are a gang of other fruits and vegetables that contain more vitamin C per serving than an actual orange. What are some of those fruits and vegetables? Kiwis, papaya, strawberries, bell peppers, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, kale. All of these foods, all of these fruits and vegetables that I just mentioned contain more vitamin C per serving than an actual orange. And vitamin C is a water soluble vitamin, meaning our storage internally of that vitamin is very low. So we have to get vitamin C on a daily basis. So you have to make sure you are consuming the adequate amount of vitamin C each and every day. So you wanna make sure that you are eating these foods that I mentioned every day. What is the recommended intake of vitamin C per day? Well, it's 75 milligrams uh, for women 90 milligrams for men. That's what they recommend. So you want to make sure that you are consuming those foods that I mentioned on a daily basis so that you can get the adequate amount of vitamin C. Vitamin C is also important for the absorption of iron. So if you get enough vitamin C and you consume in foods that are high in iron, then the iron is being properly absorbed by the body because you have an adequate amount of vitamin C. Also, one thing that can impact or two things that can impact the quality of vitamin C or the quality of the vitamin C in a particular food. Two things, you got heat, air. So if you cook vitamin C at too high of a temperature, if you cook a food that contains vitamin C at too high of a temperature, then the vitamin C will be impacted negatively. If you expose a food that contains vitamin C to air for too long, the vitamin C will diminish. So you want to make sure that you are consuming the foods that I mentioned in a raw state. And then if you blend them and juice them, you want to make sure that you drink the juice or you drink, you drink the smoothie ASAP. Do not expose it. Do not expose it to the air for a long time. Don't leave it out without a covering, without a top, without a lid for a long time. So make sure you drink the smoothie or the, ju or the juice ASAP so you can get all of the vitamin C. And make sure you are consuming the fruits and the vegetables in a raw state. Do not cook those vegetables because that will diminish the vitamin C content of the particular food. So make sure we get our vitamin C in, y'all. Be healthy. Peace.